So this morning we got up early and we came down here and we got out our minibus and lay down on the road to use our bodies to get in the way of um, the work of war. So that's, that was one of our aims today, um, to disrupt the kind of the workings of the nuclear missile base. It's a place where they put the um, fissile material together, they make the warheads, they make the nuclear warheads, the things that actually detonate and set off a nuclear bomb. That's what's done here. I think a lot of people my age don't know a lot about Trident. Um, I'm new to the UK, this is something I didn't grow up with and um, now that it's part of my taxes, now that it's part of my responsibility uh, as a resident here, I think I'm I'm really interested in learning more about it, you know, meeting the people who have been around protesting Trident for so long and sharing that knowledge with other people. Trident doesn't really defend us. It gives us the option of retaliation or aggression, not defence. If there's a threat, nuclear weapons won't be able to stop that threat. They will only be able to create some kind of revenge, which has no practical use whatsoever. Trident is not a chewing gum, it's actually a nuclear weapons base, it's a submarine. People should know that Britain is continuing to modernise and increase their nuclear weapons capability. It's state terrorism, we have to stop it. I'm here because I feel compelled by my faith to make sure that Britain doesn't invest over £205 billion into weapons that kill millions of people. And I believe that there is that of God in every person and therefore weapons of all kinds are immoral. We will be glad to, to meet you here uh, in Brookfield and in, uh, in, in, uh, in London for actions, uh, civil disobedience actions and non-violence. Um, we have to be as numerous as possible and uh, the number is our power. So come, come and join us.